This is chapter four actually. See? It's chapter four actually. Now uh, let's uh, look at this. Okay, because we are using the worksheet, uh, so actually this is chapter four. Jerome, can we continue? Now, uh, recap. Look at the first one. What can I factorize? Three. What's the answer inside? X squared minus three. It. Four x. Asha, don't say already, ah. Uh. Sean, if I take out four x, what is inside the bracket? 2xy plus 1. Alright, this is 2 mark. This is 2 mark. Oh, okay. Why is there an x? Because this is x squared. So I say x times x will give you x squared. Hafiza, is it okay? Good. Now, next one. Okay, this one you have to follow the story. Huh? So let's start. Okay. Looking at this, I have two terms. Looking at the two terms, is there something that is common? May I ask what is common? Do you agree it's x plus 1? Now, if I take out x plus 1, what is left in the first term? What is left in the first term? Can you imagine someone said 2 plus a? Do you agree it's 2 plus a? Okay, I, I try and imagine. Uh, if I have 2x plus 1, I take out x plus 1, left what? 2, right? There's a plus here, means I can copy the plus. a times x plus 1, I take out x plus 1, left what? a. So the answer is 2 plus a. Where do I get the 2? The 2 is here, the 2 is here. The plus is here, the plus is here. The A is here, the A is here. Do you follow? Nisa, try the second question and go toilet. Now. Huh? No, no, no. This is just an extension of common factor. Ah, yes, yes, yes. To expand it, you have to do this and this. Then you will get back this. Nisa? Nisa? If I look at 9y minus 2 and by minus 2, what is common? y minus 2. So can you write down y minus 2? Now, what is left your first trade term if I take out y minus 2? 9. There's a minus. I copy down the minus. The second one, I take out y minus 2 left b. So this is the answer. Is this okay? Uh, wait, wait, wait. Let me finish C first. Sorry, uh, C, C very important. But I'm losing. So my question to you is, C part 1, is A minus B equal to B minus A? Your answer is no. No is correct. My question back to you, if I want to make them equal, what is the way to make them equal? Switch. Uh, like switch like A minus B. Uh, correct. But if I don't switch, there is one more way I can make them equal. Can I share with you? Can I share with you? And it's very important way. And the way is, you just need to take out... Uh, I, I use another color. Huh? You put a minus, and then you put a bracket. Do you know, if I do it this way, they are the same? Let's try, huh? Are you writing? Written. Let's try. Uh, minus times B give you what? Minus times B give you what? Negative B. Minus times minus? 
plus a. Do check. Is it the same? Is it the same? Is it the same? It's the same. This is very, very useful. And this will save you a lot of calculation and a lot of mistakes. Okay? Now, can I present to you another question? Let's try. Huh? If I have 4 minus x, is it equal to x minus 4? Nisa answer correctly and then you can go to the toilet. After go to C. Okay, but I, I need to finish this first. Everyone copy this down. Nisa done already. Nisa, are they equal? No is correct. How can I make them equal? You put a minus, then you bracket. Before I start, huh, how many of you don't understand why these two are not equal? How many find that they are equal? Huh? How many? Not equal. Huh? Because 4 in this case is plus. 4 in this case is minus. So they are not equal. So Nisa say, I just need to put a minus <coughs> and a bracket. <coughs> you mean the question? Huh? No, no, I'm, I'm referring to this one. I'm referring to this one. This one is okay. Is this understood? Agree, yeah? Okay. Now let's go to the question. Can you help me copy the question? Can you help me copy the question? I use the color. Huh? This one I didn't change anything. So can you copy down? Then can you help me copy down? Now I'm going to ask you something. I'm going to ask you something, and you're going to tell me whether they are the same or not. Question: Is seven H four minus X the same? Yes, right. Okay, da. Is the minus the same? Yes, right. Is X minus four the same? No, right. So what must I do? I must add a what here? Plus. No, I must do something here. I must do a what expand. Okay, again, now, again, now, balik, now, balik. Okay, wait, now, wait, now. wait. Let, let me bring you through. Uh, let me bring you through. First, uh, first, if I look at B, y minus two, y minus two, is it the same? Yes, right. Can I theorize? Yes. Look at C. Four minus x, x minus four, is it the same? Again, huh? 4 minus x, x minus 4, is it the same? No. no. So can I factorize? No. Cannot. How I wish these two can switch like that. Agree? Agree? Yeah. So I switch, huh? I switch. So I, now I copy, I switch. I really switch x minus 4 to 4 minus x. But are they the same? No. They are not the same. But how do I make it the same? I must add a minus here. And I also must do a bracket do you see that x minus 4 and minus 4 minus x they are the same do you see that they are the same okay uh. wait, wait wait later i do a summary right i do, I do a conclusion this one is a uh, got a few steps in between later i just show you the final step now can you tell me what is minus or minus? Plus. Plus. So I can rewrite this as the next step. Yes. Wait, uh, let me allow me to finish this first. Uh. If I look at this statement, do I have four minus x? I also have 4 minus x. Can I factorize a 4 minus x? Yes, right? So if I factorize a 4 minus x, if I factorize the 4 minus x out, what is left inside? 
7H plus 1. If you can do this, then you are okay. Can I give you one more example to try? Am I adding more confusion? Yeah, 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 go, go, go. Can, can, can. What Ashraf is saying is, can I just rewrite this as 7H? 4 minus x plus minus x plus 4, right? Is it? Is this what you're saying? More confusing. <laughs> you mean factorize this? This one. How? Okay. Can, can, you can, you can. You see, uh, okay, let me work out what Ashraf do. Uh. I hope I don't confuse you even further. Uh, what Ashraf say is, can I expand this and write down minus x? Expand this and write down plus 4. Then this will be like that. Do you know? Do you know why is it like that? Because plus 4, what? then minus x. What? So I just swap the position. Why I swap the position is because I want 4 minus x to be obvious. This is minus x plus 4. This is 4 minus x. They are the same thing. After this, I still get this step. Do you see there's a 4 minus x on both sides? So I factorize, I still get this. Yes, yes, yes. Now, okay, uh, plus 1 because I take out I take out x minus 4. So I'm left with the 1. I take out the I take out the 4 minus x, right? I take out the 4 minus x. So this one left with 7 h. This one I take out 4 minus x, I left with plus 1. Now, can I give you one more question and then you try and see whether you understand or not? Let's try. Can everyone do can everyone do D? Let me try, uh, let me try. Let me try and come up one question, huh? Can we try the All right. Can I pause the video here and let you try? The first one contains B minus C. The second one contains C minus B. Are they the same? No. How I wish I can swap, right? How I wish I can swap, right? Agree or not? So, can I swap like that? Can I swap like that? Actually, the answer is yes. But, if I swap like that, what must I change here? This become minus. Do you follow? If I swap this to B minus C, then this will change to minus. Do you follow? Why is that so? Let me ask you a question. If I take minus 3 times B, what is it? Negative 3B. Is it the same as taking plus 3 times minus B? Same what? What of the, what's the point of swapping? If I cover the first step, the, the second step, 
can I Asha? Can I factorize B B minus C and C minus B? Can I factorize? Ah, yes, yes, yes. But with this step, can I factorize B minus C? Yes. The on top can factorize? Cannot. Bottom can factorize? Can. Do you understand now? Yes, you can. Now, uh, Orlando and Daryl is asking for the intermediate step. So let me write down. Huh? Uh, this one, there is no change. But this one, sorry, yeah. I, I, I write only. This one is minus B minus C. Daryl and Orlando is asking, can I write this? Yes. But do you know that minus and plus will give you what? Minus. So you'll get this. I'm trying to simplify the plus 3 and the minus. And what I get, I'll get minus 3. Do you follow? I'll get minus 3. Do you follow? So therefore, what is the final answer? B minus C, I factorize. Then inside, 2A minus 3. Do you understand? Can we try? Okay, okay. <coughs> Come again. This one, right? Oh, oh. Eh? no. Because minus times three is minus three. Wait, wait, wait. This is wrong. This is wrong. It should be this. It should be this. You see, what you do is you swap the two, right? So it becomes B minus C, right? Then you got to put a minus here. So therefore, this one is minus. Do you follow? Okay, now. Uh, lesson over, huh? Now, can I end it off with one more example? Cannot already, uh. Can I end off with one more example? Cannot already. Okay. Hey, I... What is going on, huh? Hey, I feel that... Uh, okay, I can, I can, I can feel... Mr. Chong coming over already. Now, can you write down E question? And do you know the answer for this? Can I write down the final answer tomorrow I go through this? Right. In between, there is a few steps. Can you go and fill it up? Is this okay?